you guys, welcome back to the bat. Back to the bat prototype. <sighs> I really gotta put lights up there, but I wanna use fancy lights, but I can't do that right now because I would need to go get some Owie Glow Dust. I don't remember if I showed you guys before, but I put up a fence because I was tired of them knocking on the door. <laughs> so, what I'm going to be covering in this one is... Oh, did I already get all of them? Huh. Anyways, um, some Tinker Construct stuff because I really, 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 really need uh, more useful tools. So... I showed you guys how to create that in another video previously. I did make another chest because the last one got blown up and a bunch of stencils. So what I'm going to be adding here is this lovely little thing, um, the tool forge, because uh, there, what is it? It's the, uh, I think it's just the tool station, I think. Yeah, it doesn't have everything I want in it. But this one does. As you can see, I've kind of changed some stuff up a little bit. You know what? Why don't I just do... This. <laughs> okay, as you can see, there is a bunch of these lovelies um, that you can't get in the other one. Um, so, for example, what I will need to do... I don't know if you can hear my kid. He is not happy. Um, is make some, some stencil paper. I can't remember what it's called. Like pattern paper. Put those extras there. It's very easy to make. These are all very beginning. Um stuff, uh, beginning level when you start. So you can actually make some of these more advanced things if you have a smeltery pretty quickly. Um, but anyways, I needed a hammerhead pattern. And then I go over here to the part builder. Oh, don't need that. I stick that here and then Oh, do I? What do I need here? Thanks. I need to use the same one, I believe. You put that right here, and then you get this lovely little. And then I've already melted some gold to make the patterns, but this is when you use the um, crafting table. You throw that down on top and you use either aluminum brass or gold uh, will work. And you pour it right over. And then you get your pattern. And then a piece of useless wood. <laughs> So basically, I'm making a bunch of things. <laughs> uh, let's see what the... Uh, the hammer is basically going to take place of the... Uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, oh, the pick pickaxe. And what it does is do a 3x3. Three three. Um, well, it kind of describes it in that little info box um, space. And you can make tunnels very quickly and depending on what you make it out of which I've already uh, forged a bunch of steel clearly because uh, that's a really durable and not too expensive to make um, metal you can fill up these patterns with uh, basically I'm going to 
actually throw those in now since they won't mix with the gold. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, what else did I need? I think I have everything else for the hammer, which is right here. <laughs> I'm gonna need to do two of those, but I also wanna make the lumber. Do I have everything I need there? Yep. Excavator. Yep. Oh, did I need? I think I needed a. Uh, I think I need a. Uh, what is it called? A. Uh, does it say over here? I think. I think I need to use the. Broad axe. Let's see. <laughs> the other part builders is useful for some basic stuff. For sure. Put those back in here. And honestly, once you've got these, these can also go in here and you really don't need the patterns it gives anymore. Um, so I'll probably end up burning them. <laughs> okay, good. That's kind of why I'm throwing the miscellaneous um, pieces in there, because I can actually burn them later. I need a What else can I make here? Hmm. necessarily need that yet. So what I'll do here now to get uh, the gold um, out of the smelter, smeltery, Ugh, I can't talk today, uh, quicker it's just using the uh, basin to fill it up faster. All this is being extremely loud in his bedroom. He's being very destructive. Um, this will probably be a pretty quiet uh, round. Okay, because I don't want to just have a waste six gold, because gold isn't as common as uh, everything else. But once I get the gold out, I can show you using these other patterns. 
You can also fill up buckets. Um, if you look in the uh, recipe list, um, you can have like a bucket of steel and whatnot. You could also, if you have an opening, and try not to kill yourself, but um, you can also, if you injure yourself, because if you go in there where there's stuff in there, um, it will injure you. <laughs> And uh, you can actually fill a bucket of blood that way. Let me empty some of this out. Getting small more steel because I'm probably going to need it. So. Let's go. Gonna make a. Let me see how many I need. Uh, hammer. One. Two. I know that the heads of the weapons don't need a bunch. That's why you need a lot to make weapons. <laughs> Hopefully I'm making the right size. Sometimes I don't, but it'll be useful later. This is going to be one I may need to make another one. All right. So let's wait till that one pulls up. Ah. Is that enough? No, it's not enough. So I have got to <sighs> cook some more steel. Fun times. So what can I make? One. So Okay, so where's the axe head? Haha. -ha. And nope. I'm going to have to wait for more steel. But just a little tip here. If you take even your regular weapons, I think, too, um, put it here, and to fix it, you'd put like some steel right here, and it will repair it. But I can show you what the axe can do. It should do three by three as well.
Yay, it's the tree feller option. So this makes for much easier um, removal of trees by a lot. Uh, same thing kind of works with the hammer as a replacement for the pickaxe and the chisel for a replacement for the shovel. So that's incredibly fun. <laughs> Yay! Well, that's doing that. Cook me some more! I'm saving a bunch of wood here because it's all going to end up being used to cook a lot because it the steam dynamo eats a lot of it. Actually I can put a lot of these back. have to go through that later because that's exciting <laughs> all right to show you how this one works. Uh-uh. Since this is all damaged over here. See? Very easy break of... Ah! Let's see. Hammer. There we go, there, and ta -da. And with the repairing option, you can also not only put your uh, weapon tools here and repair them, but you can also, uh, let's see, um, as the modifiers, you can use things like diamonds, redstone, lapis, and they all kind of do different things. Some. I think redstone does repairing, like self-repair. Um, there's just a variety of things you can do with it. So it's actually very useful. Uh, these aren't necessarily as, steel isn't as durable as diamond, but it definitely uh, helps plenty to have them available. Um, oh, and I also wanted to show you guys what else I've done. I've made a glass area and I'll show you how to do that as well. Um, but all of this stuff I've found so far for food, ooh, uh, I've planted. I've got carrots, potatoes, and turnips. I kind of have everything kind of in a similar look if that makes sense. <laughs> like these are kind of growing below. These are flowering, which is a belladonna and mandrake. Be careful of the mandrake because a little creature can come out occasionally. Strawberry and coffee beans. We got rice and barley and wheat. And we've got cotton and tomatoes. And 
uh, snowbells drop snowballs, and um, I'll have to go look, but they're like little icicle needles, which are used in witchcraft uh, in-game. I've got my sugar cane growing, I've got my pineapple growing. If you hit pineapple, well, with the sword, you get, what is it called, uh, pineapple cubes. And if you hit it with anything else, you get just the head of the pineapple. And I have blackberry bushes growing here. I will eventually collect them all. Uh, let me think. Okay. So that's kind of what, what's growing there. Um, and where is it? Okay, so how I got the glass is uh, you use this and you make a chisel. There are two different types, but this is one you don't need to uh, make through like part builder. Uh, what you do is you need four iron and one stick and kind of do the top corner of the crafting box with the stick at the bottom. And you put glass here and you can get a variety of things. I think, yeah, see, you can get different types of dirt. Uh, I don't know if it'll do it with, no, it won't do it with that. Uh, but um, a lot of blocks have alternative uh, looks to it, which is actually kind of fun. So on that note, I think I will leave you guys hanging. I will say the um, these lovely little things. I eventually want to create platinum, which you need to uh, pulverize your fervus or fer fervus. I don't know. And it'll give you pulverized uh, that, but sometimes it'll drop shiny metal. And if you uh, smelt that, it'll make it into platinum. And that's probably the speediest um, mining and whatnot. So that is that for this round. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye.